I love hearing from new users and uh, that video looks pretty cool where OpenStack is out there like building things. So something that we, uh, we introduced in Paris was the super user award that we give away each summit for users who are um, doing really cool things with OpenStack and also contributing back to the community um, you know, for everybody's benefit. And so the way that we do this is we have super user magazine. You can see that superuser.openstack.org. And we also have a special print edition here for this summit. And uh, there are judges, an editorial board that help to, um, to collect from the nominees a set of, uh, of, of finalists. And we had a really great set of nominees this time around. Um, there were uh, uh, 10 nominees that were from four different continents. And you know, they're not only using OpenStack in their business, but they're contributing back and giving back to the community. Uh, for example, the OpenStack team at the Distributed Systems Lab at Federal University of Campina Grande in Brazil was the number one organization for code commits during a research organization for code commits in the Mitaka cycle. Swisscom's team uses OpenStack to uh, develop and deploy Cloud Foundry. We talked about uh, those different models earlier. And Overstock.com is contributing to operator documentation for Magnum, which is uh, some, a request that I've heard pretty commonly for people who want to get started with Magnum. And all of these people are you know, doing a lot for, uh, for OpenStack and for the community. You can learn more about all of them in that print edition of Superuser Magazine here. In Tokyo, the, uh, the Superuser Award winner was the team at NTT. And so to introduce the finalists and also to announce the winner of the Super User Award this summit, I want to bring up Toshikatsu Ichikawa and Shintaro Mitsuno from NTT. Thank you, Jonathan. And good morning, everyone. Uh, my name is Shintaro Mizuno, and this is my colleague Toshikazu Ichikawa. And we re represent NTT Group. So we were honored to win the Super User Award in Tokyo last year, and we are very excited to present the Super User Award today here in Austin. So here are the finalists. The first, final, the first finalist, OpenStack-based integrated cloud is deployed in production at 74 sites globally. They are planning 90% growth, moving to 100, more than 100 production app and network clouds by the end of 2016. Congratulations to the team at at and t <laughs> so much. So this team is working toward 1,300 hypervisors across two data centers to support around 200 applications, serving more than 120 daily transactions and more than 2.7 billion API calls. Congratulations to the team at Bitfair. In March 2016, the next generation general availability region of Dream Compute hit the scene. Built to scale with customer demand, it has a utilization of over one terabyte of RAM, more than 700 virtual cores, and nearly 50 terabyte of block and object storage, supporting tens of thousands of customers. Congratulations to the Dream host team. Including the development environments, this company has more than 650 servers running OpenStack services and more than 50,000 cores. And by the, the second quarter of 2016, they will triple the total capacity. Congratulations, Workday. Each of the finalists will be speaking at the summit this week, 
where you can learn more about their particular use case. And now, we are happy to announce the winner of this year's Super Use Award. Drum roll, please. And the winner is AT&T. Congratulations, AT&T. Come up on the stage. Yes, join us on stage. Come on up, AT&T. Now, I, I think we told them they, uh, they could only have 15, but I see <laughs> they... Uh, I know how that works, you know. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. you guys did similar. Okay. Congratulations. Hey, congratulations. Thank you. All right. So I think we're going to grab a quick photo here. Thank you. Thank you. Kirby, why don't you give me this award there? Yeah. All right. Uh, for your fabulous win here, so you guys know, the next OpenStack Summit is going to be in Barcelona. And as the winning team, we are sending you guys all on an awesome tour of Barcelona. Barcelona is an incredible city, lots of fabulous architecture, and uh, lots of good food as well. And because we had such amazing finalists, we're actually expanding the, uh, the travel prize this time. So each finalist is getting uh, one of their team members funded to have travel, lodging, um, and their access to the summit funded in Barcelona. So thank you to AT&T and to all of our finalists. Kind of like uh, the line at the grocery store, the express line, 15 items only. <laughs>